Say hello everybody, this is Vitaly here at Red Barn Productions and today we're going to talk a little bit on how to set up XSplit and Skype so you can bring Skype into your live streams. I do the live in five weeknights at 8 p.m. over on Facebook and I just started using XSplit and last night was the first time that I tried to bring Skype over into the live stream and I ran into a whole bunch of problems so I went online there's not any support really online the videos on YouTube I hate to say this but all the videos that are up on YouTube are crap so I thought today that I would make a, a, a video showing you how I did it and, and solve most of my problems and hopefully it won't be that long so let's get started and open up Skype I should have already had this open Skype open now. And the first thing we're going to do is we're going to click on tools. And then we're going to go to options. We're going to go to video settings. And I've already got it done. But where it says select webcam, when you click on it, there will be an option to choose XSplit Broadcaster. You're going to choose the XSplit Broadcaster and click Save. We're going to go back to Tools, click Options. We're going to go to Audio Settings. Now, again, I've already got it set up, but I have a few options, and we're going to use the Blue Yeti Pro, and we're going to choose that. And here where it says Speakers, as you can see, I've got several options, and I'm going to tell it to use speakers, XSplit Stream, Audio Renderer, and I'm going to click Save. We've got Skype set up. Uh, unfortunately, there's not really an easy way for me to do a screen grab, but then I'm going to come back over to XSplit, and I'm going to check uh, right there next to the, the speaker icon. There's a, a, a little gear for settings. Click on that. And this window will open up and we're going to go to audio and you can say audio preview I have none uh, my speakers are, the, are my computer speakers and I, I have a few options there but we're going to use this, the computer speakers the microphone we're going to make sure that it's the, the Blue Yeti Pro of course I had to set up a little bit of delay Mine was 100 milliseconds. Yours may be more or less. You'll just have to experiment with that and see. And we're going to click OK. Let me see if I can figure out how to do a screen grab without messing this up. And of course, we're going to get all that. And I can't help it. But down here, if you if you can ignore all the tunneling in the, the bar down here where it says add, we're going to click add, and we're going to come to widgets, and we're going to add Skype video. We're going to click add, and as you can see, it popped up. Let's come to another screen so we can, and I'm going to go ahead and add it on this screen here, but you, you now know how to do it. Click the add button, click widgets. And I'm going to add the Skype video. And then I will, of course, re hold on. Unfortunately, I do not have anybody to call in and, and, and do a test call for you, but that is how you set up Skype and XSplit. So you can bring Skype over into a live call and vice versa. You could also use XSplit as your webcam during Skype. I hope that helps. Uh, and once again, I do the live in five 
weeknights over on Facebook. There'll be a link in the video description below, 8, 8 p.m. Central Time, U.S. Uh, we do take call-ins, and it's basically what that's for is to help uh, artists, anybody that works in the arts and entertainment industry, be it musicians, bands, uh, comedians, stand-up comedy, spoken word, uh, if you're a painter or a photographer or cinematographer and you're trying to get people to come over and check out your work, uh, we let you share your links, we bring your, your pages or your stuff up into the, the live stream and we discuss what's going on and, and try to get people to come over and check you out. <coughs> Once again, this is Vitaly here at Red Barn Productions and y'all have a great day.